Hello, my friends, and welcome back. Thank you very much for being with me again today. Now, this is funny. <laughs> this is funny. Uh, the European Union threatens Poland. <laughs> threatens Poland with sanctions. Can you think of another country that uh, sanctions were imposed by the European Union? <laughs> I can uh, come with one suggestion. Uh, Russia. <laughs> So Russia is saying, like, come over, Poland, come in our on our team, come over. Those are idiots. And Poland is like, no, I have my masters there. So what am I going to do? I tell you what Poland will do. Poland one day will say to the European Union, hey, motherfuckers, I can queue up if I want. OK, and by the way, you don't tell me what to do. Those guys tell me what to do. Zimbabwe from across the Atlantic tell them, tells me what to do. So shut the up, otherwise I'm going to smack you. This is what Poland will do one day. Mark my words, I'm 99% certain. Uh, Poland arms itself like there's no tomorrow, my friends. I wonder why. And I was trying to figure it out. It can't be the Russians. It can't be the Americans. Who can it be? Germans? No, because Germans are the U.S. Uh, um, occupation. So there's the 51st state. The 51st state, actually, it's a different one. <laughs> I can mention that. The name that uh, should not, must not be named. Uh, you know who that is. But actually, that's not the 51st. It's the one. And United States is the, <laughs> uh, the guy in chains. Hey, let me take the chains off. Jump. All right. Now, good boy. Now, which one I don't like? Which one is against? Okay, this. Go and get M1. And it says, woo, 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 comes back. Can you guess who that is? Uh, yeah, yeah, exactly. <laughs> so now Poland is not Poland. Poland, maybe it armed itself against the European Union somehow. But who can stand against it? Friends, in order for friends to do something, it has to first wake up from uh, last night's uh, wine. Okay, uh, friends will not beat anyone. Uh, an old lady in Alzheimer's will not be able to beat. But anyway, that's my funny uh, thing about France. And in order for France to get to Poland, has to cross over Germany. And that's uh, American territory. You can't do that. So Great Britain, Great Britain are again a uh, part partner, are a partner with Poland with the same boss. So again, no. Could that could that be Russia? No, because Russia was almost beaten. We're told by Ukraine with about what twelve HIMARS, and Poland is buying five hundred. So don't you think about that with five hundred, Russia will not be in the first thirty seconds of the fight? I think so. So it can't be Russia. So what happened now? Let me show you here. Ukrainska Pravda. EU may impose sanctions on Poland if embargo on Ukrainian grain not lifted. Well, the Poles have balls. I said this before, and that's true. That means they will look like the Hungarians. You know, they look for their own, uh, own nation's well-being. That's the way it should be. Well, Brussels doesn't like that. The guys who control Brussels don't like that. Doesn't like they don't like that. And who are they? Well, we know. Well, we can't. Uh, the name that should not be named. Well, we know who they are. Okay. So, nevertheless, Poland uh, does certain things that benefit uh, the Poles, and the guys over there are upset about it. What's going to happen? They're going to sanction the Poles because of the. Um, Ukrainian grain, because the Poles are protecting their agriculture, their products, because these guys are coming with a, a dumping price, the Ukrainians. Therefore, we're going to destroy their industry. So the Poles said, ho, 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 hold on, hold on, hold on, yet. I don't, know, I don't think it's yet in, uh, in uh, Poland, but anyway, uh, in Polish. I don't know how it, what it is. So I never does. No, 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 you can't do that. But the guys in the Brussels who think that they are in charge, they say, hey, and they think they're in charge. They have no power. They have no power. You uh, Remember, Poland has an army. European Union doesn't have an army. Brussels doesn't have an army. You have an army? No. Get the f out. Remember when Stalin spoke with that weasel, what's his name, uh, Truman, the hero that dropped two atomic bombs on two civilian cities, remember? That guy who killed, what, uh, about 200,000 people in two seconds, pam pam, okay, remember the guy? Yeah, that hero, um, you know what I mean, he told Stalin, hey, Joe, um, uh, when they were drawing the map, you know, the free world, 
was discussing with a criminal uh, communist, Stalin, uh, who's going to get what? They were partitioning countries. And they talk about Russia now, about Donbass and Crimea. Please, shut up, cop. Okay? You did this in 45. And before 45, during the war, they partitioned and they said, this is yours, this is mine. This is my sphere of influence, that's yours. And the, the guy, Adolf, supposedly wanted the same thing, didn't he? I want to rule the world. Well, these guys, after the world killed uh, Great Britain, Great Britain lost all its uh, base, basically became bankrupt with no colonies, with nothing. That, that's what Great Britain uh, succeeded after the Second World War. We will fight in the air, we will fight in the landing ground, we will fight on the beaches, we will never surrender! Okay, you will never surrender, but you lost everything. Congratulations! Now go and shut up. up. Good job, Churchill, good job. Anyway, so uh, he said uh, Truman towards Stalin, Hey, um, uh, Joseph, buddy, Joseph, <laughs> um, the Pope, you know, uh, has some concerns and he would like you to uh, be kind with uh, a Catholic population of Poland. And Stalin like, says, all right, how many divisions, arm, armed divisions, does the Pope have in Poland? What did uh, the hero of America say? Fuck. Zero. Therefore, shut up. Ah, the same thing here. Poland will sell Brussels. How many divisions divisions you got? How many high mars you got? Zero. So, fuck up. Okay? So, that's what's going to happen. I think Poland, at one point, the Poles with Poles will just go their own way. Or they will just go rogue. Like, you know what? We are in the European Union and you have to suck our thing if you want us in. And if you don't want us in, just kick us out. You, you, you're going to sanction me? I'm going to sanction you. And remember, remember the Visegrad countries? Well, it was uh, Czech Republic, Slovakia, Hungary, and Poland. They might get together again, Visegrad. And that's not good. Not good. They lose that. They lose Ukraine. And then you got the weasel of Baltic states, 5 million people. Boom. That's it. What's going to happen? The European Union is going to collapse? It's very fragile. The, the how do you call it? The Soviet uh, Brussels communist system over there is going to collapse. They have nothing. Nothing. What do they have? The bankers. That's all they got. Bankers. Money. Money. Typed. Not backed by gold. By anything. No. Money. That's all they got. And they're backed by this kind of in, in interest. We're going to sanction you. Really? We're going to show up in Brussels. How about that? Who's going to stop us? The Belgian or, uh, army or something? Thank you very much for being with me again today. Stay strong, stay smart, look for the truth and be just.